couple, uh, see, he died. I am running a colder spark plug, and that's helping it stop from overheating. Bigger main jet that's getting more. People always look at you when they see you running this motor, man. They're like, that dude's got a weed eater, and he's running faster than me. And I got 55 horse, baby. It's cranking easily now. I think the idle jet on this thing is too small. What that is is a fuel filter that I have on the air vent here. We're getting closer. It's it's closer. These are just vents. You just let them dangle. So if it's anything, it's a hair lean. All right, so we moved the clip down one here. You get one of these motors, people are always going to stop and ask you questions. So just, you know, be courteous and explain, hey, man, it's just a go-kart motor. And they'll like it. And... What do you think, lean or rich? We move the one needle there, it's performing worse now. So we may need to look at the, what's going on with the mixture, the air mixture. Just as the air mixture turned it all the way in and One more run here. That's the launch. Yesterday it wasn't even idle, hardly. So today it's idling, but that idle jet got to come up some. That that spark plug is definitely in the right direction. But see this thing is this thing is leaking. It's either leaking here or here. I can't determine, but first shakedown cruise, what do you think? Let me know. I like the carburetor, I like it. But it's definitely not a plug-in and go. You're gonna have to tune and you're gonna have to experiment to find the combination that works best for you but for right now we got to get to the old day job and I actually have an order of floats to get out any of you guys not floats an order of uh, my trolling uh, jigs or whatever uh, any of you have ever thought about buying those things just go on over to the website check it out and, uh, and hey look thanks guys for watching um, I'll see you later